Good afternoon, sir. Good Good afternoon. afternoon. Thank you for joining us for the platform today. Thank you. That was an excellent, challenging presentation, if I may say so. But one thing that I wanted to ask you is what makes you so different? Because the kinds of decisions that you made in governance are not popular. Well, is a, is a decision, if you look at it, what drove me into government. Mm. I didn't have time to explain it today. I wasn't a politician. Mm. I got annoyed about something. And if you look at my campaign slogan, when I was campaigning, my campaign slogan is, is the Anambra State cost away the cost? Because kids were out of school for two years, and people, like what is said, were not interested in bringing the place down. So I wondered why are these people behaving like this? We have children who were out of school for two years, and people like me were busy training our own children abroad. Mm. The consequence that when those from abroad comes back without these people educated, they will eat them alive. Okay. You know, because there's no meeting point. So for me, going in there was to prove a point, and that, that's what I still do today. Mm. I say, what is happening in Nigeria? Why are people happy celebrating in a country okay. where young men and women who have been to school, worked hard, cannot get a job? And you're still partying. Mm. For what? Which leads me to my next question. Do you think that we, the people, encourage these things? Yes, I think so. I said, I said it. We celebrate them, because whenever people say, oh, I don't go for that. And you could see me going from one place to another, saying people are doing Thanksgiving. <laughs> I want to question how did this man, local government chairman, who was not doing something yesterday, suddenly became so rich? And what is today, it thanking God for? For stealing our money? So, how do we then begin to change the mentality of By the people? By refusing to be part of the madness. Hmm. I once refused to call somebody deathless. I'm not a saint. But I said, I told the person who insisted he would come to me, I said, no, to be excellent, at least I went to school. Mm. You have to have fair, good, very good, best, and excellent. So if I have to call his somebody his excellence, he will have at least be good. But where I think you're a failure, I can call, can call his excellence. Mm. Fantastic. And on a final note, sir, what is your message to Nigerians on this well, like I said before, well, my message is that, you know, when they talk about philosopher king, uh, I didn't want to mention that is philosophy. What I do every day is to tell people to reflect on their life. Unexamined life is not one living. And that is, how do I go home asking myself, I want to drink a good wine when I know the cost implication? That's why I saw me talking about my daughter. And I wish I can read to people what my daughter sent me two days ago. She told me after paying her school fees how lucky she was that she had a father like me, that she was looking at the newspaper and saw people going through bad wine mm. to a place they think is good. And they think this one could have been me. And that is what I try to tell everybody. Yes, don't think, oh, I finished being governor. I was living in one mansion in Ikoi of Victoria Land. If those in Ikoi will live in peace, let them not forget those in Morocco, mm. those in Ajegunle. Otherwise, they won't have peace. Thank you very much for joining us for this. Sir. The platform.